Okay, Joe, uh, disappointing day at the office. 4-2 uh, defeat at Kings Langley. What are your thoughts? Um, yeah, firstly, full credit to um, to Jordan and Mark um, and to, to Kings Langley. It's a, they're a lovely football club. You get treated really well when you come here. Um, good service, good surface, good crowd. And yeah, fair play. I thought they, um, they, they probably deserved it today. I don't think there was loads in it, but I thought that... Um, they certainly defended better than us, and we were a bit. I don't think the same hunger um, has been that, that was there today that has been there in the last three or four weeks that's got us up to this position in the league. So it may be a bit of complacency. Um, yeah, it's just you can't always hit the. It's, it's not possible to hit your best levels for every game. That's the challenge that every yeah. coach is after: is can you consistently produce your best performances in and out of possession? And there will be moments where you're slightly below par. And I think we were slightly below par defensively today. Three or four occasions, we're sloppy with clearing headers. Three or four occasions, we don't perhaps work hard enough to deal with a cross. And the goals are quite soft, but they were clinical. And, and once they got in front, um, they did a really good job in the second half of slowing it down. I think the look, the refs got to probably, yeah, refs got to probably speed them up a little bit. I think the ref allowed them to suck the life out of the game. I don't think anyone turns up at football to, to watch, to want to watch. 30 minutes of real slow and, and them taking minutes out of games but f from their point of view that's what they want and, it, and we didn't really get although we had good control of possession in the second half we were better with the ball we created more chances we they took they sort of snuffed the life out of the game really and it just sort of ground us down and then the fourth goal goes in so you know we had good chances in the second half their keepers pulled off two unbelievable saves the one off the bar and the one from the indirect free kick so we've had plenty of chances to score more than two goals but I think that we've lost the three points today by by not defending in the manner that we would expect and the manner yeah. we're going to need to to go on and, and finish in the top three, which has to be the minimum aim for us this season. Yeah, we got off to a good start, um, really. It's just frustrating to see after we conceded the first goal, we just seem to go flat. Yeah, too many long balls. Too many long balls for us today. They they were organised. The two centre-backs for them were good. The goalkeeper had a high line and they, they invited us to play longer balls because they left the space in behind. But... We couldn't resist the temptation of it and every time we shaped for a long pass they weren't holding the line they were dropping off so they were dropping off defending their box and the goalkeeper's high so the space was there if we'd have just had one or two more decoy runs and then used that space at the left and dropping off but um yeah no we didn't we just we just didn't really get into our flow you know in the first half it was a bit bitty wasn't it it was a little bit bitty and like you said um we never really got going and we never really imposed our style on them too long, too many people maybe just in and out of the game and yeah, they just punished us. Yeah, I'm just lastly, just going back to their, their goals, probably the last three goals were a combination of about six yards out, I think. Yeah, and that's disappointing because that's your heart, that's your heart of the pitch. So there has to be an unbelievable attitude um, and desire to throw your body in way, not get beat, get first to the ball, get numbers around the ball, get the second ball. We should be barking at each other and switching each other on. There should be um, maximum focus in that area and I think that there was it was a really casual we really defended our box casually and again um, yeah they had the players to punish us so really really disappointing but I just kind of finished by saying that I think that's the second game we've lost maybe the second or third probably second in about 12 or 13 so we're on a good run and yeah. we, we don't Although we've got to learn from that game today, that can't take out any belief that we've got because we've got a really good group, a really good young group that will learn from that quickly. Um, we'll stay together now and that will sharpen us and we'll be bang up for, for making it right on Tuesday and getting three points at Bedford. All right, Joe. Thanks a lot, thanks, mate. Thanks, James. Cheers.